to see video expected to be released this evening showing body camera footage in the death of Tyree Nichols in Memphis, Tennessee. He died shortly after that police encounter and now five officers have all been charged with second degree murder. The family's attorney, Benjamin Crump, who we know so well, he is speaking right now. Let's listen in. We think it's also important to the community that there is swift action and that we move swiftly to justice. I mean, cause let's be honest, let's think about it. This is not the first time that we saw police officers committing crime and engaging in excessive, brutal force against black people in America who are unarmed. But yet we have never seen swift justice like this. Think about Laquan McDonald in Chicago, Illinois. Uh, Attorney Ramanucci, where was that, over a year? 14 months, even though they had that video on day one. Think about the video of Eric Gardner in Staten Island, New York. How long it took uh, Kareem on that one. Think about all these cases, Alton Sterling, Silky in Baton Rouge, Louisiana, on video. Think about Pamela Turner, Houston, Texas, killed oh, yeah. on video. It took a year for them to bring charges in her case, even though they had the video day one. Think about Ronald Green in Louisiana. I mean, had that video for day one, took over a year to bring charges against them. I mean, so many, man, my God. Think about 14-year-old Tamir Rice on video. And Again, Benjamin Crump, the attorney for the Nichols family, says he has seen that video. We are all waiting to see it later this evening. We're going to have much more on this story when we come back. Stay with us.